hey my wonderful people how are you doing i hope you're doing well in this video what we are simply going to do is to create an animated cartoon eyes inside of canva and everything is going to be done you know from scratch so make sure you stick to the end to learn all you need to know so you can become a good canva designer okay so yeah without any further ado let's dive straight into canva and let's get started so the first thing we have to do is to come to create a design and over here you can see i have instagram searched over here okay and we have so many options but what i want us to look for is the 1080 by 1080 which is the instagram post square so make sure you are clicking on it and everything should load beautifully for you just like what i have right now okay so now that we have this the first thing we have to do is to work on the background so to do this we'll click on background color and just set any color of your choice okay so I'll just try to find any cute color. Okay. And I think something like this looks fine for me. And just in case you want to use the same dimension I'm using, you can see I'm using the D43372. That's what I'm using over here. Okay. So after we have that, the next thing we have to do is to press C on our keyboard. And just in case you see it's still on the vacation, wow. then make sure you're coming to elements. Okay. In elements, you should see shapes and just select circle from here. All right now duplicate it using ctrl d or you can just right click and you see duplicates and uh, let's select the two of them and increase the size as well nice one okay this is very easy very simple i hope you got it now there's nothing like yellow eyes if someone has yellow eyes and it means a person isn't well you get it? so we'll change this and just to change the color we'll just come here and choose white okay because yes your eyes have to be white you know most times you know yeah then what we have to do now is to duplicate the circle again and now reduce it white on white usually doesn't work that's why god in his own wisdom made it black is it the people yeah i think so so we put this here and duplicate it and place it over here you can see where we are getting to usually there are reflections and i'm sure even if you look at my eye right now you can see some reflections okay so you're going to create that and usually when it comes to these cartoon stuff they're just usually white circles okay so come into color again and just choose white okay and we'll move this here reduce the size all right and position it somewhere here it depending on where you want to put it okay so it's going to be here then we duplicate and we'll bring it here like this all right that's beautiful so select these two okay and group them using ctrl d select and group them okay so this is what we have at the moment now we want to add the eyebrow all right so to add the eyebrow just press l on your keyboard for a line and move it here now if it's too thin like this it doesn't make it interesting so come to the border or the line style and increase the width okay so something like this and make sure you're choosing um, rounded end points okay turn it on so you can have an interesting line like this okay so i'll reduce the length of the line and i think this is fine and make sure it's centered duplicate it and move it over here as well okay so this is what we have at the moment and now let's center everything okay so it's time for animation the first thing i want us to do is come to the bottom over here and click on duration okay this would help you activate the timeline in canva all right nice one then what we'll do is we'll right click and duplicate this page okay you can see what we have over here so the second page make sure you're selecting both eyes and move them here to the left you can move them anywhere you want all right then we duplicate it again then you know we can move it all the way to the right okay so it's like looking left and looking right okay then we can bring it back to the original position so all we have to do is to come to the first page and duplicate it right then you move it okay so now i want there to be a blink okay so this is what we are going to do duplicate it again the fourth page duplicate it to have the fifth page then with the circle okay the white circle we can also duplicate it we duplicate it and place it over here now with what we have in the background the same color select it okay now the only adjustment to do is that you want a darker version of that color so you just drop it down a little bit just like what i've done 
and you, you should get something like this then duplicate this and put it right on top over here okay so i'm going to duplicate this page and bring it here so because when you're blinking it's, it's fast usually fast okay if you blink right now you see it's fast <laughs> okay then i'll duplicate the blink again and bring it there so he blinks twice then you open the eyes again okay so then duplicate this and move it here i hope it's understandable okay so this will come here now before we you know animate everything we see how everything goes nicely what i really want us to do is first of all with each page you are just going to keep it 1.0 okay so the page timing 1.0 then you can click apply to all pages to so take it on and you can see it's been adjusted now let's come and give some pages extra adjustment so make sure you're climbing to zoom page not climbing coming to zoom page and click on it so that we can see zoom thumbnails okay then once you stretch it you can see what we have all right so with these ones the blink should be very fast and we'll do this one as well so these ones are going to be very very fast okay now we are done with these ones you know with the blink now i want us to work on the you know the eyes moving and all of that make sure to hover your cursor in between the pages and you should see something like add transition okay click on add transition and you should get something like this so make sure you're choosing match and move all right and do the same for the second page with you know the third page do the same for the other one okay and you can see what we have at the moment so if we are to play it this is how it's going to look like you know it's actually very fast so what we can do is we can increase the page a little bit okay so we can increase this 1.5 because it looks like it's too fast and if you take apply to all pages it will override the edit with you know we had for the blink so make sure you know just do this um take your time and just do this okay all right and we come to the third page would make it 1.5 as well and we would come to the fourth page and do the same for it as well 1.5 okay so that it's a smooth animation it doesn't have to be fast because you know it looks at you it looks to the left okay then it looks to the right and it comes back okay then even with the blink we can see that the blink is too fast sorry it's too slow so we can just reduce the duration okay by clicking and dragging just like what we are doing so let's move the timer over here and let's see nice so i think this makes sense move left move right come back to me and just blink okay and i believe this it's a beautiful tutorial we have been able to get and i hope you had fun designing this with me just in case you're looking for more interesting tutorials please make sure to hit on the subscribe button my name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity and i should see you in my next tutorial peace